Yo, what is good? It's your guy, Tico Guys, and we are back with another NBA 2K22 updates today video. And today is going to be something a lot different. This is a predictions video that you guys should know about what scans are literally are about to come. to so NBA 2K22 before the season actually drops or when the season actually drops. So before we get into the video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, subscribe to the channel. Join the current GNGs and the next GNGs, ladies and gentlemen. Join the game because it's only free to do so. And also, you ain't gonna get it like this nowhere else. Also, man, don't forget to hit that notification bell to be notified when the videos actually drop. You need to know when they come out. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Tico is to keep up with the latest and greatest updates. You need to be in sync when I drop them on YouTube. The Twitter tweet drops and you will be in sync at the same time. And also, don't forget to hit that like button. It helps us out in the YouTube algorithm tremendously. So if you do that, you help us grow and we can get to 60K because we're on a 60K grizzine. Anyway, so with that being said, today I'm going to go over all the rookies that are going to to come and all the sophomores that are going to come as far as via face scan throughout the next server update or patch in NBA 2K22 for current gen and next gen. So let's go ahead and start this thing out. Okay, so 2K TV dropped an episode. It was the last episode of 2K21 and they were out at the summer league literally scanning players and having an interview with players. I'll throw some footage on the screen so you can see. And basically what you need to know is that a lot of these face scans are already done and in 2K's system, but they just haven't hit the game yet via patch or via server update. So with that being said, we're gonna go with some players and we're gonna look at them. And we're going to figure out who's going to be added. And we're going to have the proof through these interviews of who's coming. Because if you look at some people that came to the game in the last patch, they're literally going to come in the next few patches. So let's go ahead and strap up. Let's do it. the Pelicans. We're looking for the player by the name of Trey Murphy. Now, this right here, as you can see, is not a real scan. It's not even a digital render of Trey Murphy. It's one of those 2K generic faces. And this is not what it is right now as far as Trey Murphy. He doesn't look nothing like this, but he was literally scanned in the game. So I'll throw some footage on the screen to prove to you that this guy was literally doing his thing at 2K. And for the Summer League, he was doing his thing as well. And he literally has already set for his scan. So I don't know what else to say, but to go ahead and predict that he'll be in the upcoming patch or server update that's coming soon. These are my predictions, and my predictions are pretty much always right. It just takes a little time. Chris Duarte has already been scanned into both versions of NBA 2K for current gen and next gen, both gens. So we can look at him, and you can also see footage on the screen of him having the actual interview um, with the 2K TV lady. And you see that he's in the game. Like, you see that he was around to be scanned and I don't know if they had the scan rig truck out at the summer league in Vegas or if they had like a spot that they can do it, but they literally did it. And as you can see, if I go down to dunk emotion, you see Chris Duarte. He is in the game on both gens. He's on current gen and next gen. So the next player is the rook Jalen Suggs, which Jalen Suggs, his face scan literally just hit the game the last the last patch update. And we all know that a lot of people wanted to get Jalen Suggs in the game, that we needed him because he was like in the top 10 right so anybody in the top 10 you want to be in the game and you see on the screen Jalen Suggs and I'll throw some footage on the screen of Jalen Suggs for 2k TV he's there and he's having this interview this is another situation where it proves that this guy is actually in the game via the scan that they did out at the summer league in Vegas so now we're gonna go ahead and look at the new one or uh, the one is in the game and sometimes we don't really get to sit here and just appreciate the scans and appreciate what we do have in the game and that's what I'm doing right now is just bringing your predictions video. We're going to go to Chicago, to Chi-Town, to the Bulls. And the Bulls have a really nice team. If you've been watching them in the preseason, they've really been doing an amazing job. Uh, the chemistry is already looking there. So Ayo Dasumnu. Now, Ayo Dasumnu was on 2K TV, and he was having an interview. And he literally was sit and scanned. And, yeah, he's good to go. He's going to be in the game. Be on the lookout for this scan to actually hit the game. And, of course, this is one of 2K's faces. This is not literally, like, a real scan. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. And when you see him on 2K TV, that's already a given. Sometimes running 2K will send out a some type of like uh, Instagram story or like an Instagram post or a TikTok post showing people in the scan rig, which means they are being scanned and being ready to, to getting ready to be put into the game. So be on the lookout for uh, AO that's some new as well for the Chicago Bulls. They run sharp, right? This is clearly not real. 
this actual player likeness update of their they run sharp this ain't even an update this is just like one of 2k's faces a placeholder to keep him you know there so when they drop the scan in he'll be there or just to put something in the game you know what i'm saying for us to play with but this isn't him and i did throw some 2k tv footage of him look at his hair is totally different like this guy is supposed to be looking like this you know what i'm saying <laughs> supposed to be looking like this but it's all good man it's all good um look at the screen right now this is what we have right now and that's how you know it's coming so this is another one i would actually be on the lookout for oh scotty Bowens, man this is literally the probably one of the best face scans i've seen this year in the nba 2k game for 2k 22 basically scotty Bowens looks so real and i'm gonna go ahead and throw the 2k tv footage up where he's smiling and you can see him and he talked about he's like one thing you got to get right is you get my skin right get my hair right but also get my smile right like i gotta have my smile because that's like my thing and scotty Bourne's is literally in 2k22 via the last patch so close and this is him this is his teeth this is probably one of the best like i said one of the best in the game if we can get lebron james to literally sit and get scanned and the 2k our team and dev team can do this we'll be on a whole nother level fam like to get certain players like especially your favorite players like Bron, Melo, like braided Melo. this is because this one right here is a beast these players funny because like they literally say okay get me right or you got to get this right you got to get that right so that's how you know it's going to be good especially if they request it to be perfect so let's go ahead and go to the next scan which is really not even a scan so corey kispert so corey kispert this is not a scan this is like one of the digital renders or whatever from the 2K art dev team. And it's pretty, it's pretty fire, don't get me wrong. But I'm gonna go ahead and throw the 2K TV version of him on the screen in real life. And he's out there having an interview as well, so which he was scanned. And he's on his way to NBA 2K22, current gen and next gen, and just be on the lookout. And yeah, I mean, this is just something to place hold. He also said that he wanted his headband and his hair to be correct. So maybe 2K has taken a little time to literally make sure that his scan is right because some players do want their likenesses right. You know, you got to pay these players in the NBA and they want their likenesses right because they play the game and they actually have logos and in, in park and in, in the city and, and on the cruise ship. So, you know, it's just it's just got to be right. You know, you cannot miss that. Up. Zaire Williams. This is clearly not the real face and the real face scan of Zaire. This is just a placeholder. I'm telling you, these are coming. I cannot miss. I won't miss on this one. This is coming to the game. Let me throw the 2K TV interview up where you can see a real life photo of him, a real life moving image. And this is the guy he's having his interview and he's almost literally ready to be dropped into the game. This is clearly not a real face, but I mean, it's good enough for now to play um, into something. And one thing I did notice too, when I was playing my mock career on the current gen version, when I was looking at teams I would go against, the scans that were added new, the scans that were dropped via patch were dropped into my career, I'm sorry. My my career storyline, when I was playing the game, some scans were old, the patch came in from last week and it put actually updated faces in the game. So I am pretty excited about that, that now that the faces are updated via patch and they are replaced automatically when you're in your my career. So I'm, I'm happy about that, them updates, man. Josh, you were primo. Joshua Primo. Now Joshua Primo was updated on both gens. He was updated on the current gen version and the next gen version. This is a scan. Let's go ahead and go to the 2K TV footage and we're gonna look at Joshua Primo. He's sitting in the chair, he's happy, he's excited. He's about to get scanned, was scanned in the game. Now he's in there. And the video actually starts out with him in the scan rig, which is pretty fly. So it's pretty cool, man. But let's go back to the real one. Let's go back to the Siggies, jump from the Siggies and go up to the dunk emotion and get that close up. And this is him. I don't think it get no better than this, man. This is really, really good. This is dope too. Just as dope as the Scotty Bourne's uh, scan. Josh Giddy, which he's actually playing pretty good in the preseason too, man. He was playing really well. I like what I see. Okay, see, he was getting blown out, but I mean, there's some promise to this cat. But yeah, he was literally scanned in and this is, this scan right here you're looking at like this player likeness update came from the last previous patch um for the next gen now current gen didn't get them yet current gen is a little bit slower to get these scans and updates this is him this is face and i'll go ahead and throw the 2k tv footage on the screen so you can see it and you can see the proof like 
none of this stuff is made up none of this stuff is speculation all this is proof of what's about to happen in the next patch so okay so the next player is Jalen Johnson now I heard a lot of you guys are upset about Sharif Cooper before we even jump into Jalen Johnson Sharif Cooper Sharif Cooper like Sharif Cooper is literally hooping for the Hawks like this dude is out there balling man like this little guy got heart Taylor Cooper's brother yeah this dude is doing it so 2k I don't know what's going on with Sharif Cooper and why he's not in the game. Um, we will figure that out soon. He probably will come in the next patch or the patch after that when the season starts. I'm pretty sure that 2K wants to get Sharif Cooper right. They want to get his likeness right. They want to get everything correct. And they maybe it's a contract issue. I don't know what it is, but it's something about it. So now let's go ahead and go to Jalen Johnson. Jalen Johnson is another player that was on 2K TV that does have a scan on the way. This was not updated in any previous patch update or from the lunch, the lunch update or having went out the box with 2K22 next gen and current gen, but the scan is coming. I'll throw the 2K TV footage on the screen so you can see it. This is the proof that this guy's coming. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to Siggy's, check his Siggy's out, go up close to that dunk face and check him out. This ain't, no, nah, man, that's not like him. Somebody I seen on 2K TV that got an interview that I know they got scanned for real was Kyra Lewis Jr. This Kyra Lewis Jr. was from 2K21. This was from the last version. It's in both versions like of the current gen, next gen 2K22, but we're gonna get a brand new Kyra Lewis Jr. in the game. I'll throw some 2K TV footage up where you can see him. His hair is actually different too. It's braided going back. So it's kind of like the Kawhi braids going straight to the back. And it's funny because Kawhi changed his hair to his braids hanging off and then Paul George is straight to the back. So back to Kyra Lewis Jr. Let's go ahead and throw the 2K TV footage up on the screen so you can see it. I want you to see that and kind of can gauge up and compare what's going on and what's coming because those days that they were out there getting scanned of night most likely the hairstyle and, and, and like i said this is just digital the real one's going to be the room the room is going to be not like really nice so i'm really happy to to know he's coming to the game and I, he should have a headband too because he's been hooping that one as well so ishmael wainwright um for the raptors he was an undrafted rookie and he was on 2k tv i'll go ahead and show you that on the screen right now while i look for his scan and i don't see him in the game so he's not even in the game with sharif cooper so that's two players that's not in the game now this desmond bain i don't i don't think this is a real one i'm, I'm trying to gauge it and let's go ahead and go to siggy's real quick i'm trying to gauge it and see if it was a real one but let's go down to dunk emotion and this looks like a digital render like the digital render from last year this is the same one, but it looks touched up, to be honest with you. So we'll know, like, it, it looks real, but you can tell by like how the, the clay, like the structure of the, the face is it's not, and it's just not hitting as a scan to me. It's hitting as some digital that the art team did. So with that being said, you've seen him on 2K TV. I'll throw him on the screen where you can see him and he's out there. So I'm literally thinking like all these guys got scanned into the game and they're coming really soon so we're going to have a pretty big face scan patch uh or a big patch for pro, like, pro likeness updates for 2k so be on the lookout for that i'm gonna be dropping a real crazy video in detail and comparing from last to next and it's gonna be crazy man so don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit that subscribe button it's only free to do so don't cost you nothing join the current gng's and the next gng's also don't forget to hit that notification bell to be notified when these videos drop you need to know when this stuff comes out because it's unique and also don't forget to follow me on twitter at too close to Corey because you want to keep up with the, the, the video uploads and the latest greatest stuff right if i put some out on youtube i put it on twitter at the same time and you don't miss a beat hit that like button guys it helps us a lot in the youtube algorithm we're on the road to 60k to grow the channel all day it's your boy tico man i'm about to get up out of here i got to do more videos i'm behind all right peace